this is that cream. So it's coming in a little thick, so reference your PDF. Um, but I would draw yourself one of those. So maybe it looks like this. And you can always use um, resources on the internet, right, to look up what these things actually look like if you want to get the most accurate dimensions. Like I might adjust that after because it's not quite even. Um, but maybe that's one of my themes. I drew it as a polyline. Now once I drew, draw one, I can copy that around, right? So use those tools that you know to copy things around. You'd center it on your grid line. So you don't need to be redrawing and redrawing and redrawing repetitive elements, right? Once you get one bubble with a number for your grid, copy that around and then change out the number. Um, copy, you could do a line with two grid bubbles at the end and the number, and then you could copy all of that over. Copy, 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 copy. Right, so speed up the process as you can. Use those tools you know, use the copy, use move, do all of that stuff to speed up your process. Um, so for something like this, I would try to get it as accurate as possible. Make sure things are aligned so you can use your align tool. Um, and then once you get one nice and clean, copy that around. So use those tools that you guys have been practicing and then think about crochet and adding a scale figure and tree very last. So the most important thing is to get the drawings done. Um, and then Thursday, you guys can add in those final touches. All right, any last questions on this? Once you get the file set up, it should be pretty straightforward. Um, make sure that it is scaled correctly before you start drawing because you want to get that correct so that once you bring it into Rhino, it's all good to go. Cool, okay, um, so go ahead and start setting up your file. Um, one thing that I do ask is that if you have not finished project number one, please use your own time to work on that project and finish it outside of class because I want you to stay um, on track with this project number two. Since it is the final project, it will be our final pinup. Again, no late work accepted if you missed that. Um, so if you're not done with project number one, please do that on your own time and use class time to start 